Hey guys, we're going to be using my Red Copper Chef today and doing some recipes. Make sure to hit the subscribe button and the bell to get future videos. Okay guys, so we are going to be creating some Reese's Pieces cookies in my Red Copper Chef. So I got these, I figured let's see what, what it looks like, you know, let's, let's see how it does in here. So these are not frozen. Um, they were in the, the fridge section of the freezer at the grocery store. So we're gonna see, I figure we'll put a couple in there and just see how the cookies turn out. So take, ooh, I can smell the Reese's. Oh my goodness, it smells so delicious. I don't normally do sweets, but I'm going to make an exception for this. Oh, these smell so delicious. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, they smell so delicious. Look at those. Look at those. So what we're going to do is we're going to actually take a couple of these. Oh, wow. Go ahead and do this. And then let's plop this down. Let's go ahead and take one more. And let's plop it down. Now, here we go. We're cooking cookies in this Red Copper Chef. Okay, so we put two cookies in here. These are Reese's Pieces cookies. It tells you not to eat the raw cookie dough, that it is harmful for you. So I know I give that thumbs down. I, I remember when I was a kid eating um, cookie dough and, you know, the brownie mixes and just like licking the bowl afterwards and dipping your finger in to get every last little bit of the, the stuff. It's just so good. So, so good. So anyways, it, it, they, they print that stuff on now. I, I feel for the generation today that doesn't get to experience licking a bowl uh, for, for the goodies. So let's go ahead and let's open it up. Let's see how it's doing. I'm debating whether I'm going to actually flip it or not. Um, oh, wow. Look at that. It's slowly cooking, slowly cooking. I, 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 I half want to flip it though, so we can make sure the rest of it cooks. That's, that's the one thing, because I don't want it to get too dark on the other side. And I know folks hate me opening this up, but I want to see what it looks like. So let's, we flipped it. Oh yeah. Okay. So it, it would have gotten overdone had I not flipped it. So we're going to have cookies that are done on both sides when you use the Red Copper Chef. Um, so we'll, we'll have to see how this cookie turns out in a little bit. All right, so I, again, I know folks hate it. So this is what's happening. It's cooking. Ooh, it's sliding around. Let's go ahead and flip it again, just because I don't want it to get too burnt. Um, I can actually smell it cooking. So, oh yeah, see, look at that. You can see the Reese's. Hopefully this actually gets done. I, I don't know. We will definitely see. This is what it looks like so far. Let's slide a little bit. Um, it is not getting done in the center. So hopefully we can get this done. It's going to be like an egg is. Um, so the biscuits did great. Um, the cookies kind of, eh, we'll see how it turns out. Okay, guys, we're going to flip again. Here we go. We flipped. Let's see how it looks. Oh, wow. Okay, so this is like, I, I just don't think it's going to be a hard cookie. Um, I definitely smell the peanut butter in this Reese's because um, it is like, I think it's a peanut butter Reese's cookie. I can definitely smell it. Um, yeah. Yeah. It's slowly getting done, slowly. So we'll see. Okay, well, I see some steam coming out. Ooh, look at that. Okay, it's slowly getting done. I think some of it, let's, let's just, it's gonna be kind of like a brownie almost, a little bit mushy. Hmm. 
Okay, cookies with stuff probably are not very good. It's caramelized the peanut butter and the Reese's in here like it did the Junior Mints and the Brownie Mix that we did. Um, so, yeah. Um, but, I mean, it's cooking. I mean, it, it's cooked. Like, it's it's a soft cookie that's crumbling a little bit. Um, but it's cooked. Hmm. Yeah, I I would say this is probably a don't do this one again sort of dish. Um, anyways, but it would be good to try a cookie without any sort of uh, item in it. So maybe just like a, a sugar cookie, um, maybe a plain chocolate cookie, no chocolate chips in it. Um, you know, maybe, maybe chocolate chips would be okay. I don't know. Um, it's just like with the caramelization of stuff, it's just not the best. So anyways, guys, hope you enjoyed this video today. And there is our finished product.